Hey, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. This is Praveen here and we have today a special guest with us whose name is Abhishek. Uh, he is from a non-IT background and he has completely shifted to IT right now. And very interesting podcast because he has changed completely his bench journey into a success story. So over to you, Abhishek. Please introduce yourself to our audience. Hi, Praveen. Anna. Hi, audience. My name is Abhishek. I have a total of 2.8 of experience in Infosys. And I did master's in organic chemistry. After my organic chemistry, I got into this DevOps. First, I got opportunity in Infosys. There, I got uh, bench. Actually, 2.5 years, I was in bench only. After that, I got some support project. There, I worked in support project around three or three to four months. Then, I got offer in DevOps with some 275% hike. So, during my journey, I was did many projects, like projects from YouTube only. Okay. I did projects from Provin Provin Bo videos, like other videos like that like the deploying applications and all. Okay. This is my journey, short journey. Okay, you have told very short, but let's go deep yeah. that. Like I wanted to know, I am very much curious, how was your college <laughs> lifestyle? Like uh, you are telling MPC you have done, then organic chemistry. So how did huh. you select that and why you wanted to move to IT after that? Initially, I was go, go on, gone in a flow actually. Everybody is doing something. Okay, I, 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 I choose my course right? Okay. Then I applied for master's for in organic chemistry. Then I I got an offer there. So then I joined into organic chemistry, some university. Then I did master's there. Then I got a campus placement in, from the course side. Then I realized in the lockdown, I realized, okay, this is not my field. I want some challenging day-to-day -day life. I want one nice profession, the work culture in IT field, the okay. futuristic minds, the people work here. This all inspired me to come to IT field. Then I tried on DevOps. Then I looked into DevOps what I can, where is the chance I can get to IT. Then I got opportunity in Infosys. Then I joined Infosys. But after joining Infosys, my life was like hurdles actually completely. I got into Infosys completely bench, bench, bench. Okay. How much okay. I try also, I was in bench only. Okay. Okay. Uh, later, so, I got into support. Hmm. Correct, correct. Finance. So tell me one thing. Tell me one thing. So here are a very interesting point. So how from a non-IT background you got into Infosys? Because people try to analyze ki I want BTEC candidate only. I want a candidate who is in degree. How did you manage that basically? And what was the process? You applied off campus, like outside your friend's referral. What was the process you followed? I applied off campus. I applied many interviews. Off, off. I, once I fixed to come to IT, okay. my day was like applying, applying, applying only. Okay, so okay. And giving the assessments links will come. Once I give the assessment links, interview won't be will come. This kind of failures I, I faced many actually. Mm -hmm, you know? mm -hmm. Once I got the offer from it, like Infosys interview came after mm -hmm. the assessment round clear. Then I explained myself like uh, I am a from non-IT student, but I can, you can assume me like that I can work on it. I have contents on that. Correct. And I have a very good te technical knowledge. I have quick learning skill. I can literally put this on my work and I can bring the results like that. I, I explain with the contents. Okay. So they given me opportunity, fortunately. Okay, fortunately. That's really good. So basically how many rounds you had? So you cleared the inf interview, uh, written interview initially. There was an exam for Infosys and then the ah. interview got scheduled, right? Yes, yes, sir. Okay, good. Only so two rounds interview. One is assessment, one is interview. Oh, okay, okay. That's good. That's good. That's really good. So you where, where you got placed in Infosys? Like which campus? What was the journey? Because they give training also, right? So after training, you you were completely on bench for 2.5 years. Huh. Uh, so, like I placed in the Bangalore, Bangalore office, Bangalore Infosys. Okay. My training was completely virtual only. I didn't been to Mysore. Okay, so okay. virtual training completely. That too from non it I don't have prior any any experience. Correct, correct, my, correct. First time my laptop was using after my completion of Marshes. That time. <laughs> okay. uh, then virtual training, that too I didn't got anything. My training was on .NET full stack. Mm -hmm. so, no coding knowledge, nothing. And they'd explain something, something. I didn't get it, anything. Okay, okay. And hopefully I cleared the training. After that, I was trying for DevOps role, DevOps project. Okay. But I didn't get it on that. Okay. So I was on bench only. Okay. So but, tell me one thing. Like I want to uh, listen from you very elaborately. How did you convert mm -hmm. your bench period of 2.5 years of experience into a project experience and got the next offer from Infosys to other company? Can you tell like what you have done exactly in that 2.5 years? How did you fill your resume? 2.5 years, I think I, I did three things. One is I did a AWS certification. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
that too from offline institute like uh, i got a free voucher from the offline institute i went right. to exam hall offline exam not the virtual okay. exam okay. so i cleared the aws cloud practitioner certification which okay. helped me to get interviews i i'll i'll, I'll hope maybe correct my first correct then there is a guy in my friends list actually he was working mm-hmm. in devops not okay. exactly devops an operations team Mm-hmm. So I used to sit with him. I used to understand the workflow, how exactly the tickets will be sold, how the bug tickets will be sold, right, right. how they'll monitor, how the how they'll check the logs, and how they'll debug the issues. These things I checked from my friend. Other thing is from the YouTube. I did projects like uh, how to deploy an Thetan application to Kubernetes by following the AWS tech stack, right. uh, by following the DevOps tech stack, tech stack. These things I did. Yeah, by understanding the projects, then thoroughly like converting into my understanding. Then explaining the interview with my knowledge actually, my way of explanation. Correct. That's very the example for everything. Uh, yeah. Like touching, giving my my touch. Mm. Correct. Yeah, That's really good. Applying in. Yeah. That's really good. So tell me one thing. Like in this, uh, when you were preparing resume, how many projects you have kept? Because people generally come to me with this question only. I am in bench. What to do? How to keep the projects? So can you tell me like how many projects you put in resume? how did you prepare your resume any kind of such suggestions you want to give to the people those who are watching you i like yesterday you see, you, you made a video on like eight years resume correct like that only i prepared my resume but my my resume is one page resume okay uh, i didn't put the projects i put the experience beside below that experience i put the roles awesome and responses of that experience mm-hmm. okay okay mm-hmm. how awesome many responses. projects you put Two only, you know. Two, two. Like okay. two roles. My I got of like promotion from okay. associate to senior system associate. Correct, correct. So that was two. I made it two column like that. Okay, good, good. Understood, understood. So after Infosys, how was your journey? So you went to support role, right? After Infosys, so how was that? Which company you got? How much hike you got there? Can you tell about that story? Because uh, from non IT, you came to Infosys, then two point five years into completely on bench, and now uh-huh. a shift. So, how was your next role after Infosys? Like currently, I'm serving notice period in Infosys only. Right? Okay. I got off. Serving notice period. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm serving notice period. Okay. Like I give an interview, many many interviews. Like no, for applying also for day in each day I used to apply thirty plus applications. Good. Apply, good. apply, apply. I don't get the mail. I don't get the response back. Correct. This time I'm many faced. I give an interview for Accenture. Okay. It is completely on the AWS developer role. Correct. So they asked me about the Python AWS services, and they told me they at the end of the interview like you need to improve a lot. We are hiring for a, only for AWS completely on AWS, not the complete yeah. diverse tech stack. Correct. Like that, they asked me. Okay, then I took the feedback. Then I improved myself. And then I worked on more on the interview side actually. Okay. Before I was trying on the hands-on side. Now I work more on the interview side. Then I got offer from Xperia. It was four round interview. Oh, four rounds of interview. Ah, no. Okay. Interview level was medium only, not too tough. Mm-hmm. But four round, interview, including the HR round, and I got two seventy five percent hike. Two seventy five percent hike. Ah, my starting package was very low. Correct, correct. And compared to that, it was good. Good, very, good. You know, That's good. That's good. So, what you are uh, thinking about the current job market? Because you told you are applying thirty uh, different kinds of uh, applications mm-hmm. daily. But you only got call from Accenture and Experian and few other companies. So, what is your take mm. that current job market? How it is? If a fresher is trying for a job, if experience two years is trying for a job, how is the current job market? The market is good, not too much good. Market is good, but only for selected candidates, na. Yes. The people who are very good at the projects and the resume. Yeah. Resume is key for picking the. Correct. Resume. Correct. So resume is important. Call uh, loans come. Correct. I change my resume a lot. Like okay. depends on the description. I changed it. Okay. Okay. Finally, I got it one. Good. Good. And I'm still tell trying me. to get the. Okay. Still, you are. That's good. So tell me one thing. In Infosys, ninety days notice period is there, right? Ah, uh, no. How how are you tackling that? Because you are in a bench and you are telling like still you are serving notice period. How are you tackling that? That also when I when interview call na HR will call na the last call was not notice period. Ninety days na immediately they'll cut the call. Correct. Correct. Uh, 90 days getting interview call is really tough. I told my HR like I have 90 days of notice period, but it is negotiable with my manager as my project is about to end. I can negotiate with my manager like that. I said, okay. so they said okay, and my interview process also took more than one and a half month actually for oh. four rounds. Oh, okay. that much time. They took. 
so i convinced him any they like anyway good good that's good i that's said 90 good. days and negotiable mm-hmm. okay good so you are serving complete 90 days or you talked with your manager and uh, how was that i need to add to talk na okay. like anyway my any support project correct thinking so to release me soon okay good good okay good so tell me one thing uh, you were in bench for 2.5 years and you got one internal project infosys right support project after that ah, no. so what is that support project it's a google workspace support na i need to deal with customers it's a chat support chat support i need to chat with customers uh, again a non it uh, work only you are just chatting with the customers solving their issues uh, okay. non it in the sense completely technical support only gmail support it is okay i need to solve the gmail issues okay but it's completely uh, different from the aws and devops there correct. is no link at all uh, yeah. that's Correct. Sir. Support. Correct. I need to deal with customers. I need to resolve their issues. Correct. Correct. So tell me one thing. Like, what job portals you were constantly applying? Let's say, like, Nokri, LinkedIn. What else you have the job portals? Can you take like brief two, time? Hmm. Two mainly. Now one is LinkedIn. Daily I use open the LinkedIn. There I follow few HR pages. Okay. From there they posted some jobs for oh. like jobs. From that I'll apply. Okay. Other one is normally applying in the job section in the LinkedIn. Oh. Hmm. And Glassdoor mainly. This offer I got from Glassdoor only. Oh, Glassdoor, Glassdoor direct jobs. Ha na. Oh, Glassdoor. It will direct to sometime. It will direct to that one. Indeed also. Oh, Indeed. Many, 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 But Glassdoor is ha. good. They are really like active on that Glassdoor also. Ha na. I am getting like many many openings there. Oh, the Glassdoor. It? Oh, okay. Like okay. I'll, I'll hmm. add a filter in the Bangalore location only. I want a job like that. Okay. Bangalore and Hyderabad only. I'll try. Okay. so there i'll apply many okay good good so xperia you got from glassdoor only glassdoor only okay i was not aware maybe i should also look, <laughs> look out for uh, glassdoor that's really good so tell me like you had any uh, offer negotiation or they only said like okay we are going to give you this much package uh, this much is your package and uh, you join with us what was the moment uh, the happy moment because from infosys i would assume like your package mine was like 3.3 lpa i used to get around 20 20- Yeah, so you how than less than that? So I think like BCA, uh-huh. Bcom, like that nineteen nineteen thousand per month, two point eight or something uh-huh. around that, right? Uh-huh. Yeah, exactly. Right. Uh-huh. So how was the Xperia uh, conversion? So HR only said, or you asked KR, uh, I want this much package. What was that? <laughs> In the HR round, about uh, they explained me about the role and all, mm-hmm. about the work from office and all, and they asked me about the what is the expected expected compensation. Mm-hmm. Then I did a research before that only, right. like uh, how much is Xperia offering and all. Mm-hmm. Then they are offering little bit high only compared to the job market. Okay. So I I was in a mind like I will ask eight to ten lakhs like that I was in mind. Correct. Correct. Then I asked like after checking their offer, mm-hmm. then I asked about around nine to eleven lakhs. Correct. Good. So they give more than that. Good. Only. Good. That's good. That's good. So really. Like uh, we'll check with our internal team. There are right. few other candidates also five to six people also. Correct, correct. After interviewing them, we'll get back to you. Like then they said, once oh. HR round is done, they took ten days time. Okay, okay. In so days, in the ten days, uh, you got fear whether I will get the offer or not. Uh, what will be my process? Did you had any thought in mind? Yes, sir. No, I got it. Like I was felt a little bit bad because I expected more based on my package and based on my performance. Mm-hmm. I expected more. Like okay. that, I should have expected be a little bit less than I thought. Okay. But they give. More than that. Okay, good. That's really good. That's really yeah. good. So, what is your feeling right now? See, your entire journey is very good. Like non-IT, yeah. organic chemistry. Then in lockdown, you thought like, no, I want to come to IT. You prepared. You learned from yourself. You had your friends. You sat with your friends to understand how was the project structure and all. Mm-hmm. Now you you are dreaming of something where from a very low package, you are going into a good package right now for two point eight or two point five years of experience. What is your feeling right now? feeling very happy na okay. like all my friends all my college friends are completely from different background only only few are there two or three people are there mm. they are from it background to uh, like this much package is correct correct really that's, happy. that's good that's good uh, kind so of i believe ha huh. go ahead go confidence ahead confidence actually correct, correct. Uh, the confidence which which i can carry the yes. other things also that's very important to check like uh, what i am thinking about from your journey is you will achieve like you still work hard to achieve more greater good opportunities 
uh, and I want to see you. Like you also told me, you will give mock interview once uh, you crack any good product based company. Maybe down the line, Absolutely. down the line, if you get any Walmart, Amazon, we will again meet yeah. and uh, we will do a mock interview with you uh, for sure. And thanks a lot for your time. I was really uh, uh, happy with uh, the way you have told about Notice Spirit. Very genuine talk. Uh, the way you have put projects in resume, even though you are bench, very genuine talk. Thanks a lot. Any one suggestion to freshers and uh, two years of experience you want to give before we end this uh, video? For two years experience, I can say work more on the hands-on hmm. and interview preparation. Okay. Like people might have like they have very good knowledge on the hands-on experience, but they can't expert, express it on the interviewer to the exactly in the confidence way like that interviewer needs to be convinced that I, we can work on this like that, Perfect. that they need to work on it the, for experience. For freshers also, it's so kind of same. No? They need to Perfect. portray themselves as a confidence guy. Good. Like what are the tech stack they give, what are the technology they give, I can work on it like that. They, they need to portray in the interview. Good. They good. work on this, I can, I'm sure that they'll get it. The offer. Good, good, good. So thanks a lot, Abhishek, for your time. Really nice talking with you. Yes, and uh, we will meet again soon. Okay. Yeah, soon. Pakka. Great. So uh, guys, if you have liked the video, please like the video and subscribe to the channel and share the link with your friends. Uh, thanks a lot. Do check out the description. All the links are there. I'll share the Abhishek uh, uh, LinkedIn ID also. You can connect with him. Again, thanks a lot. Take care. Bye.